Well, my friends, it's that time of year again. It's the holiday season, and I gotta be honest with you, I'm big on the holiday season. Ever since I was a little kid, my parents always respected Christmas, Christmas Eve, and they made all these huge preparations around the holiday. There were a lot of people coming and going from our place, a lot of food, a lot of, well, mistletoe everywhere, the tree was all nicely decorated, my pop used to dress up as Santa Claus for me and my bro um, when, when we were little. It, it was truly magical. Of course, we grew up, we grew out of it, and we know there's... we know, right? But that doesn't mean I don't respect the holidays, and that doesn't mean I don't celebrate with all my might. Now that said, my friends, I'm gonna be taking a couple of weeks off because it's been a long year. You might say, hey, Lazar, what's the, what's the point of this video? What have you called us here today? Well, I wanna do two major things which I always believe should be done up front. I wanna thank you guys for a fantastic year, so thank you guys so much for all the support you have given me. It means the world to me and we have reached new heights. We're gonna make 2020 even better than before. And the second thing that I want to do is wish you guys happy holidays with your loved ones. I don't know what you believe. What you don't believe, honestly, is not really any of my business. But during the holiday season, I wish you guys a happy holiday season. And that's pretty much it. Those are the two major reasons why I wanted to do this. But of course, now I'm gonna keep on rambling because why the hell not? Let's talk about Warframe. Yes, we are still heavily focused on Warframe. And I'll be honest with you, 2019 wasn't the best year for Warframe. Uh-uh. 2018 was a better year. And I do love Railjack and all the additions that they put into the game, but they missed a couple of marks, especially considering that Railjack, in order for it to hit home, at least from my subjective point of view, was supposed to be launched somewhere in November. And we didn't get the new war either, and I know a lot of you guys were really, really excited about that one. But what can you do? Beggars can't be choosy. I still believe 2018 was a better year for Warframe. 2019 brought a lot of disgruntled voices to the community, and I can't exactly disagree with them on most of their points, so there's that. I'm hoping that 2020 will be a better year for the game. On a personal level, I don't have a problem with Warframe, I'm fine with it. I don't play it that much to be annoyed or angry with it. Warframe is a fantastic game, but let's be honest here. There's plenty of other awesome games out there. And come going into 2020, I'm super interested in uh, Path of Exile. I think I'm going to bring you guys some content for that. I'm also very, very interested in Lost Ark. Did you guys see any footage on that? It's a game that is coming from the West. And right now, you can't really play it in Europe without jumping through some hoops, which I don't want to jump through. But as soon as that game is more accessible, I'm going to bring you guys footage. I'm going to bring you guys vids, guides streams basically the works i'm really interested in that game it looks amazing honestly it does it's an arpg diablo style and of course yes i'm also interested in diablo 4 but that's still a long ways away that's it my friends during the holiday season i like to take some time off just like mostly everybody to spend some time with my wife my family and enjoy the holidays for the next two to three weeks for the next two to three weeks there will be very little content on YouTube and basically nothing on Twitch. As before, there might be a surprise stream every now and again. And of course, I will let you guys know via Twitch, via Facebook, via Twitter, via Discord. By the way, if you want to go join on Discord, link in the description down below. Fantastic community, beautiful people. You'll love them. And I think that's pretty much it. Again, for the next two to three weeks, content will be scarce. Not completely gone, but scarce as the holidays roll in. And to be honest, I cannot freaking wait. Every time there's a break coming up, I always gotta justify, justify to myself, like, it's okay, you can take a break, you worked enough, just relax. <laughs> I don't know if you guys get like that, I'm assuming some of you at least do. And that's it, thank you guys so much, and I'll catch you in 2020. Bye.